Come on. We can't stay here. Uh, uh, hang on. I need a minute. Okay. Erst mal. Lausch mal erstmal. Vielleicht sagen die ja was Besonderes. Can you stand up? It's okay. Take your time. Slowly. Oh, it's no fucking use. No way I'm walking out of here. Well, it won't be your fault. Ich glaube, der hält nicht mehr lange aus. Na, wie geht's denn so? Shit. Hello, Big B. Hallo. I hope you come to your senses. Crooked man's the one you want. But of course, you're too much of an idiot to see that. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. That it, Sheriff. I had to say goodbyes first. Please, Sheriff. Der ist doch schon tot. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. He's dying. Vivian, you can't seriously want to protect this guy. You know what he did. I'm not going anywhere. Sie hat mir gar nicht geantwortet. It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're dead. Look, I know he made a few mistakes. We all have. What? He made sure they couldn't talk with those damn ribbons, and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Doesn't that bother you even a little, knowing that man murdered... Of course it does. Those girls... So it's all my fucking fault, then. I you didn't fucking... Mean... Ah! You're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf, too? You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? What do you mean? I did what I had to! You can't fucking blame me for that. You didn't have to do anything. Like hell I didn't. Look, Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can imagine, the crooked man wasn't too thrilled. But of course, the big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. So he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says or I'm the one getting dealt with. So I fucking killed him. And I'd do it again. Because it's not my fault. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill them. And then he fucking sold me out. The both of you can go rot in hell. George. You think I'm the one to fucking blame? That's not what I meant. I was just trying... You're still the one who pulled the trigger. Nobody held your hand and made you go through with it. Brian, believe what you want. I can tell you've made up your mind. Doesn't matter if it's fucking true or not. Go ahead and kill me then, but it won't bring back Lily or Faith. It won't free your friend Narissa. And I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. Und jetzt? It must be so easy being you. Just come in here and blame me for all this shit. Job's done, right? George is the bad guy. It's all his fucking fault. Ugh. 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 But what was I supposed to do? Du hast you don't know what it's like, Bigby. How could you know? At the end of the day, you're just like him. Coming here, talking about options, like it was that simple. You could have done anything else. You could have let them go. You could have freed Faith and Lily from those fucking ribbons instead of murdering them. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. If I freed them, what would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. So you tell me, if freeing Lily meant she had to die, you still think I had a fucking choice? What are you doing? Wait, how is she involved in all this? This is the original. Original was. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off, couldn't talk about it. She used her little purple ribbon to make more of them. To keep our girls quiet. To ensure absolute discretion. You promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. You know up? what happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. What's then? So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? We were supposed to look out for each other. I trusted you. You can't fucking blame me. You're not innocent here either. I know that. But did it have to be like this? Wait. Those were your ribbons? You're in on this? I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand. Nobody was supposed to die. When yeah. we built this place, it, 
It was just a stupid idea. A gimmick. Discretion is our guarantee. That's how it started, anyway. This was supposed to be our place. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us or use us. That was the point. And the yeah. crooked man showed up, and everything just turned to shit. Yeah, Zvekok. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... If you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right ahead. Kill her then. What are you doing? Break the spell. Why should you get to decide? Either of you. You think this is hard for you? You should be the sheriff. My life is such a fucking burden on your conscience. Don't I get a say? It's my life. Like it was either of yours to give up in the first place. Vivian, this is the way it has to be. I know that. Wait. But you're not going to be the one to do it. Doch. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just do what they want with my life. I thought it would be different here. Du musst sterben. It's all the fucking same. Vivian, I didn't mean... Do you think I wanted to be this person? What I did to Faith and Lily? To all of them. Vivian, wait. I... Every day I have to look Gwen and Hans in the eye and pretend I don't care. I have to forget what I've done to them. What I took away from them. I look at Nerissa and I hate myself. Vivian! I can't pretend anymore. What are you doing? Vivian! Don't! Uh, uh, Vivian! There. No! Uh. Fuck! No, 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 no! This habe ich jetzt nicht gewollt. Und oh, nicht erwartet. Do that, Vivian! Krass. Vivian! Shit! Ich kann gar nichts sagen. Vivian! I didn't fucking mean it! I was just. Uh. Krass, Romeo und Julia. Ohne Gift. Krass, beide sterben jetzt. Alter, das war aber ein scharfes Band. Oh, fuck! Get up! Get up! Das eine Gedärm oder was? Bleh. I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Versprochen. Really fuck him up for me, all right? Warum ist es dir so wichtig? Do you care? Shouldn't you be more worried about yourself here? Just wanted a nice image to part on. Old foundry by the river, all right? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. <laughs> You want to finish me off now? <laughs> or do you plan to kick me around a little first? Rip my limbs off one by one? That's what you want to do, right? That's not who I am. Sure it's not. No more games, all right? We okay. both know how this ends. <laughs> yeah. Just make it quick. Okay. I know what I did. <laughs> Let's not draw this out. Sieh nur, was du angerichtet hast. Ich werde dir kein einfaches Ende geben. Tu ich nicht. What? You're just gonna leave me here. Ruhe in Schmerzen. I won't be a killer, Georgie. You selfish bastard. Fuck you. Das hast du dir selbst eingebrockt. Wie geht's jetzt weiter? Zwei sind weg. Wer ist der nächste? Jersey? Aber George hat einen interessanten Dialekt gehabt, so ein, so ein Newcastle-Akzent, so ein Newcastle-Dialekt. Erinnert mich irgendwie an Jordi Shaw. Aber na gut. Pudding and Pie ist jetzt Geschichte. Die Lichter sind aus.